Okay. Hey YouTube. So this is going to be another video about um, my MCM bag I just recently received from my husband for Christmas. I just did a video about one I just received recently. I'm going to call this a re-unboxing. So I'm just showing you how it came. So look, it came in a box like this, right? This is my black one, not the cognac one I just I just received. So if you haven't saw that video, go ahead and check that out. This is a black, large MCM bag. And when I say large, it is huge. I just wanted to show you guys the box it came in because he ordered it online. <clears throat> and since it was Christmas time, what they did is it was wrapped in this MCM wrapping paper. So I just saved that so you can see how that looks. Also, it came with a little Christmas card that said thank you on it. I mean, it was a nice little card inside. And if you didn't know, MCM bags come with this nice, soft, pillowcase-like bag just to store your purse in, okay? Now, this is my black, oh, it's backwards, sorry. My all black MCM logo bag. Now, I needed a black bag, you know, of course, to be more versatile and match more things. What doesn't match black? So, this purse is really big, and what I'll probably do is bring my other MCM medium bag and sit it next to it, just to give you an idea of the size difference. First off, this has a zipper on it. My other MCM bag does not have the zipper on it. This isn't the one that has the little like bungee cord type of um, buckles on it. It's very sturdy. Some people may even want to use this as a travel bag because it's so big, you could fit so much in it. And me, I'm gonna be, I, I will junk a purse out. I will fill a purse up. So I have to be careful how much stuff I put in here because after a while, my shoulder hurts. But let me just take out all the stuff in. That came inside. Yes, I did. I kept everything inside that box. Maybe eventually I was going to want to do a video. And look, it does come with this little smaller tote bag, which can be used as like a clutch purse. Then you have your little warranty information right here. It does come with a one year warranty on your purse which I think is amazing. It's checkered black and white on the inside of this little clutch purse. You could just use this for a whole nother outfit where you just wanna have a little small bag. Or if you wanna give this as a gift to someone who will be grateful and take care of it, that would be nice as well. This purse is humongous inside. You could fit a lot in here. Look at that. But it is not reversible. This is not the reversible bag like the medium one. And there's no side zip pockets to put lip gloss or pins or anything like that. So my suggestion to you is to get you a smaller purse insert. Something like this. Can you see that? Don't judge. It's just a clear little bag with a few little things in it. Stuff that I didn't want rolling around inside my purse, getting the inside of it all dirty. Get you a little change purse. You know, just something, because you don't want to mess up the inside of your bag. This purse, I want to make sure I have it correct. This purse retails for, from MCM.com, I believe it was $690. Let's see, MCM. I'm trying to look it up real quick because I want to make sure I have this 100% correct. But yes, it's just shy of $700. Large tote. So, or Neiman Marcus says $655. So yeah, so it's, 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 it's around that area. But yeah, $690, Bloomingdale. So yeah, so this came from MCM.com. It was $690. I 
think it's great. It's amazing, but it's big. And like I said, I tend to put, because you know when you have kids, you want to throw snacks in there. I throw a couple bottle of waters in there. I have my 9mm, don't judge. I put everything in here, and after a while, like I said, my, my shoulder hurts. But it's great because you're not limited as to what you can put in it. But let me go ahead and grab my cognac purse that I just did a video about. Sitting next to it just to show you the difference in the size. Right back. Okay, and I noticed too, there's even a difference in the size of the little bags that it came with. Can you guys see that? So this is bigger. Just slightly, just a little bit. So your large bag comes with a smaller um, mini bag. I'm just gonna call it a clutch, a smaller clutch bag. So let's just sit that there, if that'll stay. Okay, now look, you guys. This is the cognac purse. I just did an unboxing of this. This is brand new. I haven't even wore it yet. So you can kind of tell it's like stiff. It hasn't really been broken. But can you see the size difference? I mean, some of you might think it looked the same. It's not. This one is reversible. It's tan and beige on the inside. This one isn't reverse, reversible. It's black and white on the inside. This purse can actually fit inside comfortably. That just goes to show you the difference. So there is a difference between the, the large and the medium. There's a big difference. And then this comes with that. So and like I said, I got this one December 25th, and this one just a couple days ago. This one came from MCM.com. This one came from Saks. The price difference is about, this one is $5.90, this one is $6.90. So this is, I guess this is turned into a little comparison video. And the main difference is the size and the price. A little over $100 difference. So yeah, and the size of the bags that it came with, different. They're both great quality purses though. I love this color. Um, this is my first large one. I have one in red that I received for my birthday. I'll do a video about that one maybe later. But I want to say, if you were to ask me which one is my favorite, I would say so far this one. And then my red one is the second, and this is the third. This is just a giant. A giant. It just reminds you of something you travel with. I love it. But um, if you're walking through a big crowd of people and this is on your on your shoulder, you're going to have to excuse yourself because you're going to bump a few people if you're in a big crowd with this purse. I mean, this one too. Sometimes with this one, you really got to squeeze your way and maneuver through crowds of people. But yeah. So those are the main differences. And thank you so much for watching. And I hope that I answered any questions you may have had about either purses, either of these purses. But yeah, zip it right up just like that. I didn't even take this plastic piece off of this yet for some reason. But yeah, it's pretty dope. Nice solid at the bottom. Like I said, get you something so all your belongings are not just rolling around on the inside, getting inside of your purse dirty like a pins or if the lotion bottle comes open. You know the type of stuff we have in our purses. You don't want to mess that up. You spend good money for something. You want to keep it up and good as long as possible. Okay. All right. If you have any questions, let me know. Thank you for watching my video.